our project Valley of the Sunflowers is to fill a vacant lot with sunflowers and to work with high school students to take the seeds and make biofuel. My name is Kenny Barrett. For the past three years, I've been working on an urban agriculture experiment called Grow House, where we work with community building, local food, and revitalization. We now have an opportunity to take our growing know-how across the streets to the vacant lots to grow these sunflowers. A city council person once asked me, how far is too far to walk? When you hit a vacant lot, you've walked too far. I'm Cindy, I'm a small business owner, a community organizer, an architect once described our district as one filled with missing teeth. What will the future look like for downtown Phoenix and Roosevelt Row? The empty lots remind me of a blank canvas. At Bioscience High School, we try to find creative solutions for our future. The vacant lots are a canvas that can be improved by our creative solutions. Everybody loves sunflowers. So we came up with this idea to plant sunflowers between the Bioscience High School, the businesses, and the residents. Valley of the Sunflowers demonstrates that art can be a catalyst for community change. Sunflowers can reduce urban blight by temporarily activating and beautifying a two-acre vacant lot. Can be an alternative energy experiment by turning sunflower seed oil into fuel for our biodiesel slash solar powered car. Sunflowers can bring excitement and inspiration to downtown Phoenix. This project can be a transformative educational experience for local students while contributing to urban vibrancy and catalyzing conversations about what the future of Phoenix could be. By contributing to this project, you help this artist bring together Roosevelt Row businesses, residents, and the Bioscience High School students to come together to plant the seeds for urban vibrancy. By supporting this project, you fill a vacant lot with sunflowers.